Hey guys, hope you're doing well. I'm your host, Tyrannus Senpai, and welcome back to another Beast of the Mesozoic Tyrannosaur series news video. Today, we got some news. Excuse me, I'm holding back a cough. We got some news regarding the newest sculpt in the Tyrannosaur series and the completion of a prototype that I am very happy to be sharing with you guys. So, without further ado, let's go ahead and get started. First off, we're going to be talking about the Dritosaurus Equanlungius, because boy oh boy have we been waiting for this one. This one is now getting its sculpt done, and it actually looks really interesting. Um, I like the detail on this. I really do. It's really a nice transition between the scales and the feathers. I'm sorry if I don't sound very convincing. I'm still very sick. <coughs> Case in point. But anyway... Uh, the, the transition between the scales and the feathers looks nice, like, these blend in so well. And look at how tiny these scales are, just dot, 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 and these feathers. Well, imagine it's quite painstaking to sculpt them too, because there's so many just dot, 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 everywhere, it's just dots. But these look like these have actually been grooved into the sculpt, but honestly, it still looks really good. Now. I want to say a little something about David Silva and how quickly this uh, project is going. I feel like it's moving at a very fast pace. Like ever since the Kickstarter uh, d date was announced, it's been a quick process. We've been getting new information regarding the Tyrannosaur series almost every day. It's kind of crazy and it's also keeping YouTubers like me busy. <laughs> Would I say they're he's going too fast I don't think I'd really say that I mean the man's got a deadline now so obviously he's doing God's work with getting these figures done his timing couldn't really be more perfect I'm really excited about this and he's obviously still putting a lot of love and time into making these beautiful sculpts and painting them and showing them off to the public I mean it's moving a little quickly but, I think that all in all, it's not taking away from the quality of these figures. I mean, look at this. This looks beautiful. And of course, we still have that, um, what was it? The Electrosaurus sculpt that's not completed yet. And we're getting information on this, too. And let's not forget the dialogue. That's also in progress, too. There's so much David Silva is completing. And within a, such a short amount of time, we literally have less than two months before the Kickstarter goes live. And Jesus Christ, he's working at such a high speed and it's so good. And it's producing beautiful models like this Dryptosaurus here. I definitely can't wait to see what the full result's gonna look like, especially considering what David Silva's promising us here. Anyway, the second bit of news is regarding the Tyrannosaurus Rex, the 118 scale figure specifically, because the prototype is finished and oh my, God, this is beyond a doubt the most beautiful T Rex I've ever seen. I remember seeing the concept art for the first time, I think it was earlier this year. I think it was, I don't remember, but I remember seeing this and I lost my mind. I, I absolutely lost my fucking mind. And now, seeing the prototype painted, ah, oh, it does the concept art this year does this no justice it's it's flawless it is by far the most beautiful tyrannosaurus rex i have ever seen and i am definitely getting this one for sure this prototype has made it concrete i also love that he put in the juvenile t-rex here for scale and it's tiny it's absolutely minuscule also i want to point out that this t-rex is no longer on a stand it's actually uh, standing perfectly on its own, so that must mean that the juvenile Rex has pecked feet too. And oh lord, it's this big thing stacks compared to this. It's gigantic. This is 27 inches right here. This is what 20, 27 inches looks like compared to this. This thing's ginormous, and I love it. Also, can I just point out that there's a Godzilla figure in the background here? I have no idea why I feel like pointing that out, but there it is. That is something that David Silva did do in the past, but I don't think he does that anymore because NECA no longer has the license. But anyway, that aside, 
I love this T-Rex. I love every detail of it. The dark browns, the rusty reds, the off-white, the, the, and the really bright blue eyes are so hypnotic, so beautiful. I can't wait to see what the gal photo gallery of this T-Rex is going to be like, because it looks phenomenal. I cannot fault this T-Rex. I'm already reviewing it, and it's not even out yet. <laughs> but all in all, still a really good looking Tyrannosaurus Rex, and I definitely can't wait to see it. Hopefully, I can also get this thing into Kickstarter. If not, I'll just settle for the Walking with Dinosaurs one. But even so, I will get this T-Rex. There's no doubt about it. There's nothing you can do to stop me. I'll also pick up this little guy just because he's so darn cute. Also, I just want to review the two of them. Like, compare this one to this one. But anyway, you guys, that's all I got to say. What do you think of this T-Rex prototype now that it's all painted and stuff? Obviously, I'm really excited about it. I'm getting very wet dreams just thinking about it <laughs> and of course what are your thoughts on the progress of the Dryptosaurus skull obviously i think it looks really good with the scales and the feathers it's not done but it's getting there plus i think this will be the first dinosaur um, in the tyrannosaur line or any of the lines ever that'll have a combination of scales and feathers uh, that are more dramatic uh, than what we've seen in the past Let's start a conversation about this in the comments down below, you guys. But anyway, this is where I'm going to wrap up the video. If you enjoyed it, leave a like, subscribe today, hit that notification bell so you don't miss anything new. Link to the Discord in the description down below. And until next time, this is Tyrannus Senpai signing off. Alrighty then, take care now. Bye-bye then.